we got this. Uh, we got this hoodlum standing behind us. Got his. He's got his ski mask on. The shit been too long. He got a twelve gauge sawed off. He got his headlights turned off. He about to bust some shots off. Looks like he about to dust some cop tops off. Oh, if you know the song. I have no idea what you're talking about, Mama. No, I got my ski mask on. Oh, no, no, no. I got my black goes on. I got my ski mask on. I got my... Uh, 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 oh, wait, is that what it is? I can't, oh, God, no, I can't remember the words. I got my black clothes <laughs> on. Well, I got my ski mask on. Well, like ladies and gentlemen, that's Mama. Too long. I got my 12-day gate shot, shot off. I got my headlights turned off. I'm about to bust some shots off. I'm about to dust some cops off. Da, 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 da. Okay, it's a song. If anybody knows what it is, I don't know. <clears throat> okay, Mama. <laughs> as, uh, okay, I said, Mama, Mama, you know. Oh, here, here, here. That's right, as we... Oh, go ahead. As, as we let you, as we let you ramble off, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, as yeah. we have ten minutes until showtime, ladies and gentlemen. So please, TP your friends, families, uncles, everybody that can over here, because they're gonna be missing WWE Edge for tonight. As we have one hell of a card tonight. As we have Hillary Lantha taking on Allison Danes, and we cannot, you know, we cannot let all the other matches uh, fall to waste. As we also have Slade take on Vince Easterwood. Oh, I know that's gonna okay, be good. Okay, I gotta give it up for then Jasper. Then I just butchered cop killer. That's right, cause I'm a cop killer. <laughs> better you than me, cop killer. Fuck police brutality. And got Bear standing here back here, kind of looking like a hoodlum with his with his little his little beanie on. He got that baseball bat. Look like he's about ready to hurt somebody. So, um. Okay, Mama. As what? we have match three, which will be, <laughs> as we have match three, it will be, it'll be L Nikola Lukov taking on Christina Krovac. You already know that's gonna be a phenomenal match. And our main event for tonight it will be the code Cody Hewley taking on John Struck. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's got a shillelagh. You brought your shillelagh. What are you afraid they're gonna steal your lucky charms? Anyway, I'm sorry, I had to. That was horrible. But. Oh my god, Mama. <laughs> what? He brought his shillelagh. Oh no, uh. That's right, fella. That's true, uh, Mama. Ah! Also, ah! Ah! also, Mama, uh -oh. you, might, you might want to uh, check your tag. Oh, yeah, I might need to do that. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, man. I'm watching that for everyone. Oh. I would have eventually changed it one of these days. I would have realized <laughs> I had to change it, but. Um. No, it's not good. <laughs> so, uh... So I don't know that's... Actually, let's talk about what's, what's been happening recently, as we already know that Descent has been on a witch hunt as of lately. Hmm? Oh, okay, okay. I've been here, you know, commentating quite a bit, and I've kind of seen how all of this has unfolded. Well, it started out with uh, a, a backstage attack against Riker Malachi... Uh, he was uh, he was jumped as he was uh, coming out of the arena out into the back parking lot, and uh, he was jumped by some masked masked person and making threats. You know, saying he said um, that uh, you know you know he's saying what was it? What was it? One descent member down, more to go or something, and then and. Mm -hmm. Saying that he's gonna get to him all in due time. So, um, and then then it was followed up by an attack upon uh, 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 what's his name? Um, he's so forgettable. Oh, Maxwell Ryan. That's it. Um, Maxwell Ryan was attacked backstage <laughs> by the same guy. Uh, well, right, so, Maxwell then... was waiting to be uh, interviewed before Edge. Two weeks ago, and then last week, um, the same mass wrestler actually uh, managed to explode a motorcycle that had been delivered to Christina Krovax, and I mean, 
you know, fortunately, she wasn't hurt. You know, I mean, I, I don't want to see anybody get hurt. You know, obviously, it was whoever did it, you know, must have planned it so nobody would get hurt. I mean, well, her anyway. I mean, you know, a guy beating up well, her, at least... hurting a girl is one thing, but, you know, I mean, but, I mean, but, I mean, she did use it to her advantage and, uh, you know, ended up uh, hitting, was she hit Nicoletta with a crutch? Yeah. Yeah, so, um, so, Descent, kind of, uh, you know, and Christina blaming Nicoletta and saying Nicoletta was the one doing the attacks against Descent. So, I mean, it kind of seems like, uh, you know, I mean, Descent's kind of on a witch hunt, trying to figure out who this person is, <laughs> you know, and, and all the while, they're also dealing with this, uh, with uh, Kurt Bombastic and uh, the reformation of the Impact Mafia as well. That's that's right. As as we know that Descent has been under the witch house. They already claim that they've already been attacking people. I mean, they attacked Jasper the other day as well oh, yeah. as they went yes. after as well they went after the returning Tala Corvas. Right. I mean, yeah. I mean, they're just. They just, you know, I mean, they seem to be, you know, they, I mean, hell, I'm surprised they just flat out blamed, you know, said it was Kurt. You know, I mean, I mean, you don't really see Kurt around at the same time as, you know, this mystery guy. I mean, it's kind of like, how... like the whole Batman scenario, you know, I mean, you never see Bruce Wayne and Batman in the same room. So, you know. Or you never see me and Batman like in the same room, so. But I mean, you know, they're, but, I mean, they're trying but, really grasping at straws, really trying to figure out who, or you know, who, what this is all about. What are these attacks? You know, I mean, there's so many people out to get descent, and they're really just kind of, but, you know, that's grasping that's at true. Straws, trying that's to figure true. out who it but, is. You know, I mean, there's so many people. The, I mean. Go ahead. I mean, as we know that Descent has been... They're trying to find people to... They're trying to find anyone who's a, either A, been formerly associated with Impact Mafia, or B, or have the potential to join Impact Mafia. They're going after everybody. It could be... It could be me. It could be freaking anyone. It could be... It could be Bear. If, 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 if the freaking... If the descent wants to, it could be Camera Kitty. We do not want that to happen. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I mean, there's, 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 there's a multitude of people. You know, it could be. I mean, you know, uh, descent has, you know, buried. I say it's Camera Kitty. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you know, well, look, look who, look who descent has run over since they formed. I mean, you know, I mean, you know. I mean, and then the funny thing is, is it, I, I mean, it's one of those things where you kind of say, you know, it's kind of obvious and it's probably right in front of their fucking nose. And yeah, it could be Cassius. See, I mean, you know, maybe they, uh, did they notice if there was a faint smell of fried chicken? I mean, you never know. That's true. I mean, hell, it could be somebody has... close to them. It could be somebody... You know, it could be somebody who is kind of close to them. You never know. That's right. As as we know, as 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 you know, as we're talking about this, mm -hmm. ladies and gentlemen, please get more people here as we're gonna be starting the show in them exactly two minutes. So please, ladies and gentlemen, please, please keep your friends, family, circles, anybody they can down here into the Olympus Coliseum for VWE Edge. As as I'm gonna say right now, as I know I did take my medicine, so I'm I'm all good. I'm I'm gonna just tell everybody, to, you know, just make some noise when the lights go out, and pretty much when the when that screen lights up like a Christmas tree, I want everybody to go crazy, go make some. Okay, calm down, calm down. Okay, go crazy, make some noise, and and yeah, it's, yeah, it's time for no those get get insane people. <laughs>
Alright, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to VWE Edge! This is your captain speaking, Captain Falcon, alongside me with... Oh boy, I think uh, Mama's mic burnt out. Uh, oh, I'm here! Yeah, Sorry about that. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, as we're going to be having a phenomenal show for tonight. Ain't that right, Mama? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Should be, uh... Should be interesting, I'm telling you. That is right. As... Wait, oh. hold up. Well, this man has been showing a lot of promise lately, and he's been, he's been ready. As it looks like we're gonna be met by the one and only Sam the Man Singletary. Really are? Ha, huh, man! Hoi! Alright. Oh, boy. Sorry about the that. It's working, right? Uh-oh. The mic's working? What do these clowns gotta say? Yep, your mic. All right. Yep. Alright, cool. Alright, now everyone, sit down and shut up and listen. I'm not gonna stand here and beat around the bush like some stupid fucking idiot. I'm simply here for business. Now, Mr. D.H.A., Mr. David Hawk Actor, you claim to be the best. Well, obviously you're not the best if you need some little punk-ass bitch like Luciano to help you retain the title. I want you and your little bitch boy to come down to this ring right now. This is something I want to say to your guys' faces. Oh boy, I don't know if DHA or Sam are going to come out tonight. Come on, get out here now! Yeah, I don't think they're punks. coming out. Get your asses out of here right now! Okay, you know what? Fuck that shit! Okay then, David! How about this? You and me at Beach Brawl for the International Championship. And by the way, this will be a steel cage match. That way, there will be no doubt in anyone's mind who is the rightful and deserving international champion. Remember, David, they don't call me the man for nothing. I don't just come out here and run my mouth. I can actually back it up. Because I am Sam, the man, and I am simply the best. One last thing I would like to mention, before I'm really interrupted by these people that need to sit down and shut their mouths up for a second. Settle down, Sam. Settle down. Okay, what I would like to mention is this. Myself, members of the Impact Mafia, Kurt Bobastic, and the great one, Derek Colt. In case you people have forgotten this, I was once part of the original Impact Mafia. We are still friends, but right now, I'm doing my own thing while you guys focused on Descent. But the Mafia will always have my back. So you better watch your asses, DHA and Luciano. Oh. Well, I, well, he pretty much made his statement very loud and clear. He wants to get after that title that DHA has, and it's going to be a steel cage match. 
Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, that, uh, <clears throat> yeah, I mean, that, it's a very tough structure to, for a match, but when you think about it, it also keeps, uh, DHA's little, uh, panty boy, uh, uh, what is it, Sammy Swaggers, what do you call himself now, something, whatever, well, Sammy well, he, well, he's, whatever. Well, he's saying from... From what he said, does this mean that Sam is the third man, or does this mean c- because actually no? It, uh, uh, personally, I don't think it, it means that it's gonna be the, that he's think that he's the third man because he said, like he said himself, he's doing his own thing. Mm-hmm. So, but I the mean, yeah, always I mean, has his back. Mm-hmm. Huh? Uh, read into it as much as you want. I mean, there's nothing really that can be said about it. So, I mean. Okay, well, so, all right, you want me here? We'll do this. We're gonna go into our first match. Okay. Should be great. Got a got a got a bombshells match coming out first at a height of five foot seven, weighing one hundred thirty pounds, from Jacksonville, Florida. She is Hillary Landfear. All right, um, Mama, you might want to you know get a sepo or something like that because this chick has. She's not in her right mind. She has a she's pretty unstable right now, as we've been seeing for the past weeks. She's um I don't know about you, but I think she's going crazy. Mm-hmm. Eh. You say crazy, I say ring psychology. I mean Um um wait 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 uh, no we did uh, I didn't say. Hey, you can yell at him. I said uh, ring no. psychology. Hey, no, hey, 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 stop kicking the table. I mean, we already came with bulky last week. Hmm? Um, oh, she yeah, wants I people to cheer well. for her. I hope you do well. I have to stay impartial since I'm commentary, so. But good luck. I honestly don't know how how this match is gonna go. I mean, it's 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 weird. And you know, she's had a few temper tantrums. You know, I mean, it happens. And her opponent, at height of five foot seven, weighing one hundred thirty pounds, from Lisbon, Portugal. She is Allison Danes. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen, as Allison Danes will be going to Beach Ball, as she will be facing off against Maxine and Lyra Phoenix for that women's international title. As if, as we already know that she is injured on her ribs, as Lyra has injured her previously. So this is not going to be good for Allison, as she does have a match before. Oh, well, hopefully, you know, it's a week before Beach Brawl, so hopefully it's all time to recuperate a little bit, so. Hopefully, but as you see, Allison is not in a dancing mood as she as she is holding her ribs. Oh, she is, well, never mind that she is dancing, but, uh, <laughs> and never mind, she just stopped. Yeah. Does it hurt when you do that? Well, this will be a. Well, then you need to stop doing that. So, how's that old joke go? Yeah. Yeah. Does it, it hurts when I go like this? Well, don't do that. Yeah. So. And uh, really, and oh my God! Hold up! Oh. <laughs> Hillary just attacked Allison from behind. Oh, and match hasn't even started, and Hillary's already on the attack. The ref hasn't even rang the bell yet, and Hillary's already like a pit bull on Allison. Oh. 
As Jesus uh -oh. Christ! Uh oh, this is not good for us. As uh oh, oh no! As your cousin. Oh. oh yeah 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 yeah. Hillary Bobola in the ring. In the ring. Yes, please. Uh, and don't oh. don't don't hurt the. Oh God. I mean, you keep doing this, we might have to say you're crazy. In the ring. Yes, please, Hillary. In the ring. Oh my God, she tosses out some things right to. Right to the free apron. Oh my god! Going right after those ribs! <laughs> and she says, This is funny, and. Oh! Bitch slap as she smacks Alice across the face and tosses her right into the ring. Huh? Well, now can we get some decorum here? <laughs> As Hilly sh shouts at the ring. Now you want to ring the bell. I mean, oh, it's if I was the ref, ref, right? If I was the ref, I'd say, you know, I'm waiting a few minutes. Oh, go for that pin. No way. Yes, she's already going for a pin. And. Oh. Only a. Uh, it's only a two count. And Hillary is just. Hillary is just going mental right now. All right, I'm gonna call she, the kettle. I'm, I'm gonna be the pot and call the kettle black. She is psycho, so. Yeah, she's like a waste. She better watch her back. As here comes Allison. Oh my God! As she goes right on top of her, just freaking, just head pounding her. And oh, they switching up as they go for a cat fight, ladies and gentlemen. Uh -huh. Oh boy. It looks like Allison and Hillary are just pretty much brawling it out. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, they're just going back and forth. Allison beating the, the crazy blue-haired girl up. Oh. You sure? Because Allison is uh, Allison's not quite sane herself. Okay. But that's just the normal for her. Hey. Oh boy, she's shouting. I hope you're watching, Lyra. As I think she's trying, she's going to try to send a message to Lyra Phoenix. And oh, never mind. As Hillary just kicks her and tosses her right to the hmm. corner. Hmm. Oh, drops in her shoulder right into the rib cage where she's wearing those bandages. Says Hilly says, "Watch oh! it! Oh, drop kick right to the right to the chin." Ooh. And Hilly just laughs it off. She she's not right. She like she legitimately needs help. Somebody needs to I don't know who's going to help her though. Maybe my meds. I mean, no. There you go, Bear. How does that help? And looks, and oh my god, and Hillary's just mm. stomping onto Allison's ribs. <laughs> and she's trying to re injure Allison now. And oh my god, she's just choking her. Choking her. That's not a pin. She's just choking her with her foot. And the, and the ref is trying to get her off. She said her shoulders were down and oh, stop right to the t ow. Hillary is just Hillary is just on a vicious streak right now. Is this Beth Ross is going for a for one and only a two count. All right, right now that woman is like. Scared me more than a long tailed cat in a room full of rocking chairs. She's a couple McNuggets short right. of a Happy Meal. Oh! As Hilly just smacks Alice across the face, 
It just oh, tosses her right hair. out the ring. By the hair. Tearing up that weed. Watch the hair. Allison, uh, Hillary just gives Allison, a, just blows her a kiss. As she's, as she's waiting for Allison to get up. And this is bad. This is bad for Allison. And it looks like, oh, Allison caught her, caught Hillary's feet and manages to trip her. Mm. And the other way around. Huh? Yeah, yeah, Hillary like, uh, oh. kind of fallen. Oh. Yeah, but Allison Bear, Allison Bear. Bear work fast because Hillary could just go right after those ribs again, and and Allison well, does not Hillary want to get getting up. injured. Hillary's getting up though. Oh, oh, Allison. Yep, and she yes, kicks her right to gut, set her right Ooh. to corner. Uh oh, as oh, as she's going for that, I that enziguri. That corner enziguri, ow, oh, right in the head. Oh, Maybe it'll knock some sense Allison. into you. I think I know what Elsa is going for. He run after her as she goes and hits that Bronco Buster. And Allison is just dragging Hillary out of the corner now as she picks her up. And oh, oh! she went for that DT, but oh, Hillary just hey, slammed her onto the floor. Oh. And oh, this is this bad for Allison as Hillary has her, Allison in her sights right now. As she's shouting at her to get up. Here comes Air Lanfer as she hits that rebound cross body. Man, uh oh, wait a second, she's going for that f for those four corners. As Allison does not know where Hillary is as she hits that flying oh. clothesline. Oh. As Hillary is on a roll. And here comes Hillary with that, oh, that missile drop kick. As Ouch. she just hurries on up. Allison does not know where Hillary is right now. And here comes Hillary as she is at oh double knees right to the head. Ooh. And Hillary says she got this. It's done. Huh? Oh, I think Hillary is about huh? to finish this off. Huh? Oh, Tara saying night night. Oh! Oh wait, 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 wait! Pinball up one, two, and oh no! Oh, the only went to go pick her up. Allison turned it into a roll up, and Hillary cannot believe it. And oh, Hillary says, "How dare you!" Oh no, this is this is not good for Allison, because Hillary might just you know might just go right after those ribs again. As as Allison does not want to get injured. At least re injured. Yeah. And wait a She has her on top as wait a second, here comes Dawson. Oh, 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 oh my god! <coughs> Super kicked her okay. right off of those ropes. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my god. And I don't think Hilly knows where she is right now. Uh oh. And wait a second, what? Wait a second, what is she going for? Wait a second, Allison, this is a bad idea. Huh? Wait a second, wait a second. Hillary does not see Allison, and she's going for. Oh! 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 Oh!
diving DDT off the top rope. Catcher her while she's on the apron. Drives her head into the floor. Oh, oh my god. This. That, that, ow. <laughs> Uh, Allison, you okay? Unaffective. I don't know about you, but I don't know if that DT put Kylie's mindset straight again, because I don't even know. <laughs> but that was a vicious DDT. Okay. Okay. Okay, hold up. Hold up. <laughs> Allison, you need to get her in. <laughs> As Allison said, this one seems dead. Allison, are you okay? <laughs> I know you're hurt, but Jesus. Yeah, I think she's dead. That was that, that was one of the best DTs I've ever seen so far. Go for a pin! Uh, she's good for a cover. One, One, two, two three. and three. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. Allison yeah, Baines so is your this... winner. Now, I don't know if that was smart for Allison because I think she may have just injured those ribs even more. But Hillary's out. Hillary's out cold. As Allison says, Lyra, pay attention. As so, wait a second, Hilly's trying to figure out where she is right now. As that was a great win for Allison. But what was the toll? What was the toll on that? <laughs> As Elsa needs to watch it because that that could have cost that could cost her that could cost her at at Clash of the Clash of the Beach. As it's only she gets some week. rest and relaxation before that match. Right before, yeah. Indeed, and and Hillary gets back uh -huh. up and. and I think I think uh, that DT just uh, I I think that DT just oh you know, shit got Hillary even more uh, attack our table again oh shit Hillary don't Hillary don't hurt the table don't hurt the table wait stop hurting the table Hillary who's fault table didn't do anything to you come on Hillary it's not our fault that you're a couple McNuggets short of a Happy Meal oh come on Ed. oh what the oh come on. Really? Really, Hillary? Oh, come, come on! I guess it only took a while before she actually, you know, break the table. And um, oh. Mama, can you tell her that she's not fine? You're not fine. You are. Fucked up. <laughs> yeah, maybe they should make that match. <laughs> Sorry, we're the table yeah. at Beach Brawl. There you go. So. Hi, man. My God, is that. Uh, she, uh, she beat the table tonight, but yeah, whatever. Okay. Yeah. I was hoping that that, that impact with the floor would have maybe straightened her out a little bit. But you know what? Yeah, we can't be so lucky. So, um, okay, moving on. Um, That's right, ladies and gentlemen. As we move on to, well, whatever, you know, production has us move on to. Oh, good Lord. Now what? Oh, ah. what's your favorite person, Mama? Oh. They haven't sent her the glue factory yet? Yeah. 
Oh, but here comes your VWE Women's Champion, Forces Morrissey. Oh. Aren't you supposed to be getting oh, ready for your game with Mr. Ed? Uh, it was a... <laughs> no, no, it was, no, no, it, was, it was a Hillary. Yeah. Jesus, you two are going to go on forever. Ready? Are you... What? Are you... what? Uh, no, the table knew you were coming. It just wanted to kill itself. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Um, well, can we get a handyman out here to fix this table? Yeah. Yeah, she's getting ready for... Oh, looks just, like she's been getting ready for a date for, uh, her date with Mr. Ed. I'm surprised she's carrying her title. Normally, she's carrying a bag of oats that she eats from, so... Oh. There she goes with those classic jumping jacks. And she did have a match earlier on EXP, and Horses says, okay. Huh? I have a headset. Oh, you have a headset? Okay. Now that you all saw me earlier destroying that Ronnie woman, press it, right? Oh. Uh, yeah, whatever. <sighs> I've seen better wrestling in, in high schools. Well, before I knock off for the night, I have some terrible news. Oh. Right. Terrible news could only come from people that are British. Your classic, what? your classical role model cannot make it to beach ball. What? Wait a second. Hold up. Hold up. Hold. Hold what? your horses, horses. I know it's tragic news. I need to have an operation. It's bad. Possibly career threatening. What? I'm booked in at the hospital on Friday. The operation on my neck will be at exactly the time I was supposed to defend my VWE Women's Championship against Aerie. What? Really? Sadly, this means Aerie loses her championship opportunity and goes to the back of the queen. No, oh. that's Q. Get it right, Q. I know it sucks, but I need this operation. If I don't have it urgently, then my foot injury may end the group. Wait, oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, what? hold up. She said neck surgery, not foot injury. Simmer down, everyone. I cry too. But you cannot mess about with soldier injuries. Oh, my How can injury. I deliver a devastating ketamine brain busters brain buster. when I have an injured shoulder? Injured shoulder? What? That wasn't a question. I simply cannot wrestle at my current standards. If I'm living with a back injury, oh, oh my, my god. god. She's been, she's been going on WebMD too much. Look, I'm missing beach ball. I was looking forward to it because I look hot in a bikini and you all know it. But I cannot make it. I need surgery on my knee as soon as possible. And the elbow surgery is only available on Friday nights. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Sorry, Sorry, let me assure you, however, that I will defend my championship as soon as I recover from my breast augmentation surgery. Mesh is no longer the future, it's the now. <laughs> oh my god. Do be sure, however, I, when I return from surgery on my ankle, I will take on the 100% number one contender, who is most certainly Ivana Wrestle. Really? What? <laughs> what? what? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, really? <laughs> As horse says, Ivana. Oh, wait. Ow ouch, my finger. Who, who's up there at the top of the ring? Ouch, my finger. Wait. Oh, wait a second. That's Ari! <laughs> huh? Horses, you might want to watch out because that's Ari Lauren. <laughs> no, Ari doesn't wear tramp clothes. Well, it's funny. Someone seemed to have stolen Ari's clothing last week. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, actually, just uh, two days ago. I saw it flowing a sea. This must be a sea of troubles. Oh, and horse saying, back off, Harry. I've wrestled already. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> See, I have a towel. Oh. Okay, yeah, horse has been going to WebMD too much. <laughs> oh. Horse is just stretching his shoulder. Wait a second, that injured shoulder? Was it the injured ankle? Was it the injured back? Oh. Oh. And I'll be sit is, down and uh, shut up. Uh oh. The uh, Aries getting to the ring. Uh, horses, you might want to watch it. You might you might injure your head or something? Hey everybody, it's the garbage pail kid. Oh. Yeah, the horses. Why? So, how old is she? Just like dated herself with that comment. Oh, Piazzeri. Uh oh. I'll talk for her also. Hey, horses fans! I have wonderful news. So I've been in the back reading of these contracts, and I think I have a solution to this can't make the beach brawl problem. Oh really? Hmm. <laughs> oh, horse is crouching down. She says, "Oh really?" Hmm. What's the solution that Aerie has? Uh oh. It says in the contract that the match can be set for whenever we want. So I spoke to the board and they more than happily agreed to rearrange to change the match to this coming Wednesday for a class at the beach. Aren't we lucky? And the horses is livid. <laughs> oh. Oh. And she said, yup, as Aerie does her jumper jacks. No, now she's like, I have a meeting. Photo shoot with Kurt. Photo shoot with Kurt. <laughs> Wait. <coughs> no, this isn't happening? My surgery's been brought forward. To which of the 500 body parts you named off? Woo! Look forward to seeing you then. Well, just like that, ladies and gentlemen, as Ari Lauren take on the Horses Morsley for that VW Women's Championship at Class Clash at the Beach. Well, a horse is a horse, of course, of course. And her name is Horses Morrissey. So, yeah. She... Yeah. Okay, she's not scared of her, but yet, uh... She was trying to do everything to get out of the match. So, yeah. All right. Time to pay the bill. Right? <laughs> yeah, so. um, You want me to read them this time? You can read them next time, or you can read them this time? Uh, All right. Actually, yeah. Um, I'll, you can start first. I'll, well, I'll do this one, and then I'll do, I'll do this whole one, and you do it the next commercial. So, we'll do it that way. So, do you want to learn more about your favorite SL wrestlers in Second Life? TyrusDanola.blogspot.com has your information on your favorite SL wrestlers, updated weekly with new interviews. And if you're interested, please contact Tyrus Danova Sarevi in World. Team Wildfire! Wildfire! Oh, Wildfire! Anyway, whatever. Shush. Ladies and gentlemen, are you looking to up your arsenal of blazing hot videos? Team Wildfire can make that happen with 100% custom videos as well as the fire package. What is the fire package? You'll have to explain that one day. Um, catch our classes on YouTube.com slash Lyra. Oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. Team Wildfire. Oh, now I remember why I don't drink cola. Uh, or you, you can contact Lyra Phoenix or, or, or Private Pigeon over here. 
Sorry about that. Team Wildfire, it's time to burn. You get like me, Big Baby Animations by Derek Colt. Giving you brand new animation and custom moves in the world of professional wrestling and Second Life. For more information, you can contact Derek Holt in World. Want to catch the latest happenings in Second Life Wrestling? Digital Wrestling Roundtable is a bi-weekly talk show hosted by myself, Kurt Bombastic, Lalandra Lancaster, Ash Cuervo, and Maxine Darkwatch. As we discuss all the best news in SL Wrestling, we talk about all the hot topics going on in and out of the ring, and provide show results for your favorite federations. You can join us every time we're on, which yeah, it's been, which will be next Friday, right before uh, Beach Ball, um, uh, either at the DWRT studios most times at the Island of Misfit Wrestlers, or you can go to our website, join our, uh, you can join our group or our Facebook page too. Um, DWRT, we are putting the fun back in dysfunctional. Damn it. It's misspelled dysfunctional wrong. It must have been me. Simple Desires, located at the Career Sim, is a club with nightly events and DJs, including some of your favorite wrestlers from VWE on staff. Simple Desires is your one-stop shop for fun dance and music. You can also have, we also have a mall featuring a variety of different shops and stores located right across from the club. Simple Desires, your leaders in entertainment. Not only is Voodoo Cooperstone a wrestler, semi-retired, He's also a DJ. Billy. Yes. From blues to some of the most kick-ass rock and roll here at Second Life. He is appearing at such places. And, oh, and he's a cop. Sorry. He's appearing at such places as Fogbound Blues, Toby's Juke Joint, Simple Desires, and even on the web at 474themix.com or 965 Noise. Guaranteed fun, great music, and great people. Tune in, lock on, and bring those requests. Uh, you can even join his group, fans and friends of DJ Voodoo. For all the updated info, all you need to do is ask. He'll keep you dancing, head banging, or just playing rocking. VWE.cc updated regularly with results and exclusive interviews, as well as videos and merchandise from your favorite superstars and bombshells. Uh, Mr. Week of VWE, want to know a little more about what's going on within the VWE Nation? You can catch up on our site. Yes. Your one-stop shop for everything at VWE is at VWE.cc. All right. How'd that sound? Sound good? Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to VWE tonight as we are part of your, as we put on for you, for uh, for your entertainment. Please feel free to donate any possible linens behind this commentary table in the collection box behind, uh, right behind me and Captain Cockatoo. Uh, any and all donations are certainly appreciated. Um, and if you've been looking for a way to promote yourself or your place of business, outside the normal means of simple ad boards or wasting your money on classifieds. Um, uh, if you want your products or service to be seen and heard in front of a live audience as well as on demand, Virtual Wrestling Entertainment is now offering new sponsorship packages. That's right, new sponsorship packages. And sponsoring a VW is a great way to promote your products and services as we promote you through our arena, on our website, during our two weekly live shows, and on our show replays. Feel free to contact Ash Cuervo, legacy name Frankie Huntress, or Jen Parkin for our pricing packages, or you can click on one of the open ad board locations located directly above the main entrance. Thank you very much, and right. on with the show. Yes, that's right, what ladies and gentlemen. What, what is the fire package? You're going to have to explain that one these days. So. Oh, the fire package is easy. The video could be added no matter what for free. Oh, okay, whatever. Okay, so I just wanted to clarify so people would know. Um, all right, let's roll on. Next match, number two. Ooh. All right, so I'm going to, uh, you know, you want me to do? I'll do the intro for this one, if you don't mind. Go ahead. All right, so, ladies right. and gentlemen, as we start from match two, as he comes from Di Dr. Frankenfurt's castle, <laughs> weighing at 245 pounds at a height of 6'3", he is Slade. Oh boy. I don't know about you guys, but I think uh 
His nickname should be known as Dead Man Rockin'. And so here he comes right now. <laughs> now I know that VWE always brings new uniqueness down here into our shows, but this has probably been the, the most unique individual that I've seen yet. All right. Oh, oh you're talking about Slade? Oh, oh yeah. yeah. It's kind of like a cross of something from Rocky Horror Picture Show and Guns N' Roses, so. I mean, seriously, he comes into the ring and he starts playing with his guitar. Mm -hmm. What's not more awesome than that? Mm -hmm. I want to tell you right now, Slade has his hands full tonight. There he does. That's right. As introducing his opponent from the hometown of Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing at 150 pounds, at a weight of five foot eleven, he is the church boy, Vince Easterwood. Did you sit at a at a height of five foot or at a weight of five foot eleven? I said at the height of five foot eleven. No, you said at the weight of five foot eleven. I said at the height of five foot eleven. No, you said weight of five foot eleven. I heard you. So this is your man, it looks like Spence will be going up against Slade. So, uh, this could be very interesting. This is going to be a very interesting matchup here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you If you think about it, Vince looks vintage. Slade, look at him. Said you don't think you checked me enough, why don't you feel me again and then I'll feel you. Ooh. You getting a little frisky. Some out of rock like I said, he's a cross between Rocky Horror Picture Picture Show and uh, Guns N' Roses with that guitar and top hat. I'll tell you this is gonna be a pretty damn good match right here. I mean I don't know much about Slade myself, but you gotta understand Vince has that history. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> oh. And Slade with that, uh. He's quite androgynous over there. Yes, he's uh, talking very to Maxinez. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, I believe uh, both wrestlers are ready. <laughs> huh. Oh, as we're about to get this match underway. If. Okay. <laughs> as. I, I, I'm not sure how cold this matchup, to be honest. That's gonna be <laughs> interesting, as it both, looks like both uh, Slade and Vince go for a lockup. Oh, 
I'll tell you right now, is this match is going to be very interesting because we already know that, uh, oh god, that, uh, well, Vince has, has, has that history, and, oh, they're going to slay with that. That was hard. Punches and, oh, and hard headbutt by Slade. And Slade is going to pretty much town on Vince. Hmm. Interesting. Slade looks like he's having that rough, roughneck style of his. And he's just freaking just going all hard at, oh, nice back elbow sending Vince right to the mat. And Slade picks Vince up once again. Toss Vince the rope and they both hit the ropes. Here they come. And whoa! Spinning kick by Slade. Slade is just soaking in just the cheers. <laughs> and Slade's pick up pick up Vince. As this, this is not looking so good for Vince, as this is just the start of the matchup. As he tosses Vince right into the ropes, as Vince is just laying down on them. And wait, here comes Slade as he hits the ropes, running after Vince as drop kick sending Vince head over heels out of the Oof. ring. Oof. Oh my god. Uh, and Alfie's saying Slade's staying here to let him recover. Really, really, Alfie? As Vince is getting up, eh, he's a little bit wobbly, but uh oh, wait a second, here comes Slade! Oh my god! My crossbody right out of the ring! As Slade pretty much perfected that! Look at him! He's moshing! Yeah, they're all like a fool. They're trying to mosh over there. I was like, Slade is trying to get the trying to get Vince back into the ring as, as ref. No one listens to you if you if you tell him something. And Slade is just going after those going after Vince with those vicious elbows. Mm -hmm. And got came right to Vince as here he comes as oh there goes Vince as he sends Slade back with a back body drop as the ref goes for a three count right now. I was still counting as Vince gets right into the ring. As Slade gets up. So it all sounds to his back, but. Ash may have already been done as Slade is trying to get himself back into the ring. Huh? Oh, wait, he's going for. Wait a second! Small package by Vince! One! Two! And no! Only a two count! And Vince is getting up. Oh, it looks, it looks like Vince is a uh, Vince is not letting Slade breathe as he picks him up and gives him a front face lock. As this is where Vince usually wants his opponents like right in front of him, so he can like do main holds as he go for a side headlock. Oh, he takes takes Slade down. Maxine is giving uh, Vince advice, saying to stay on him. Oh, wait, but Slade's going for a pin. Is can this be it? One and no, only a one count. <laughs> and it looks like Vince is starting to stand up. Hmm. What is it? Oh, and. Slave with a hard punch right into Vince's gut as he continues. Laughs and bites right to his head. There goes Slade hitting the ropes. And Vince with a hard drop toe hold. Sending Slade right into his face. Oh. Ouch. Oh, it looks like uh, Vince is starting to pick up Slade. It goes for a wrist lock. And this is where Vince is good at. Vince is good at his submissions. 
as he oh wrist lock strike and he throws Slade right into the ropes. Wait a second, here comes Slade. And oh Vince catches him. Send him over to an armbar takedown. Hey yeah, Vince, very technical wrestler. He pulling moves out. Quicker than a jackrabbit on cocaine, I'm telling you. The jackrabbit on cocaine. <laughs> As it looks like uh, Slade is trying to get up. Slade is starting to get up. It's bad for Vince. Vince has to keep him down. And there he goes. And he goes Slade down over him for a nice arm drag. And Maxine is grinning from ear to ear right now as Vince goes to the ropes. And here he comes with a nice leg drop on to Slade. Uh, Rama, excuse me one second. Hmm? Bitch dragon slayed up! Oh! Whoa! Oh! Springboard crossbody off the ropes! Catches Vince, knocking him down! Throws Vince into the ropes! Oh, tell the world backbreaker. Ouch. That's going to leave a mark. Ooh, springboard 180, leg drop. Oh, nasty kick to the gut off the rope. Oh, nasty spinning elbow. Ah, oh. over the pin. One, two, only a two. Vince knowing exactly where he is, what's going on in the ring at least. Slate dragging him up. Oh, nasty inverted atomic drop right in the naughty parts. Good gravy. Uh, sorry about that. Oh, wait a second, what's oh, Slade going oh, for? Oh, BME! Best boots all ever! Nice. It looks like Slade has the event, the complete advantage right now. Does he have an epileptic seizure or is he trying to rock out in there? Holy shit. Trying to mosh? And Who knows? Slade is just soaking in the, the crowd right now. <laughs> and uh oh, this is bad as Vince is up already. And Slade doesn't know it. Oh boy, there goes Vince as he hits the ropes and Oh, oh wait, he oh wait, do you do you saw how the way he dodged that? Oh. He pretty much <laughs> That was awesome. Ouch! Go over to pin again! One! One two two and no, only a two count. As that was oh. a very unique way to dodge a clothesline. Right? Yeah, spinning back kick. Caught him right in the bread basket. Yeah, but it looked like he did the splits before he did that. Oh, and, oh nasty headbutt. Nasty, headbutt. nasty, nasty headbutt. Ooh. And. Oh! Oh, <laughs> oh you gotta Why be careful. He tried to go off the ropes. Vince, still getting the, 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 the burst of energy. Jumps up, he hits Slade with a hurricane run on. A nice one at that. No, it looks like Vince is getting him in front face lock. And what, what, what can Vince go, go from here as Slade is 
I mean, Slade is 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 good, but ooh, nice swing and net breaker by Vince. Uh huh. Oof. And Vince is not laying up. Vince Vince has to keep it keep it on on oh. Slade right now as he as he throws Slade right into the corner. Oh. Huh? Yeah, Vince, the wily veteran, you know, like I said. Oh, and and Vince is gonna tell the game out, but ooh, oh, to go and, oh, oh that's a good one. Nice monkey flip. flip. Shot the monkey, tossed him out the corner. Yeah, but that could pay dearly as as Slade is nearly a hundred pounds more than Vince, so that's a that's a lot of weight to monkey flip. Oh yeah. Hey, I've been in matches with Vince before, back in the day, and uh, oh, yeah. wait a second. Uh oh, what's he doing? Vince, Vince is jumping. He's going for a front foot. Oh! Guy. oh! <laughs> Caught him right across the upper half of his body. Oh, my goodness. That had to knock the wind out of him. Oh, my God. Oh, said, Vince, go for a nice lion salt. Hmm? This can be it. Huh? Is Let's go over the bed. Five, One, two, two. No. And only two. <laughs> Vince has well, to do something. Or well, at least he isn't screaming like that psycho uh, Hillary. Just as you say that. And oh, wait a second, Vince is good. Oh no, this is bad for Slade as Vince has trapped him down in the crossface as he brought him down. Got him locked in that crossface. And the reference saying, what you say, Slade, as Slade is like, nope. Trying to drag, he's trying to drag himself. Yeah, he's dragging himself oh. as he almost has those ropes. And he grabs on as Vince breaks, breaks a hold. And Slade is just trying to get to ropes, trying to get get them up. He's, he's trying to get up, but forget. I think the damage has already been done. As uh oh, Vince looks like he's ready. Vince is just waiting for Slade to get up. Uh nanny. Nobody wants to see horses. Uh, whatever they thing. I mean, do you want you to say you'll show them? Their, and you wait a second. What? What is Slade doing? Go, what is he doing? Uh, it looks like well, I think everybody's it. seen everybody's seen horses. Oh movies, my you know, god! Because of knee pads. Oh, that, was, that that I kind of knew what was going to be going. Uh, I wouldn't want to see him. And oh, uh, Vince! Oh, <laughs> Ooh, my god! As he takes him over from the top rope and just snaps him down. Yeah, sorry, oh, I don't want to see him. I don't want to see those boobies. If I look Jesus at them, Christ, well, I might turn to stone like Medusa. Um, As Slay is down right now, but Vince is picking back up. Oh, wait, oh, wait a second. Vince looks like he's going for rededication. And he nails it. Boop. And this might be it. Oh boy, and 
Vince is picking up Slade. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. oh, but wait a second. Slade counters with a wrist lock of his own and tosses Vince right into the ropes. Or the corner. Uh -huh. Wait a second. Here comes Vince as. Whoa! As he hits that slave rolling elbow. That was pretty damn cool. Hmm? Oh, oh, wait, he has Vince trapped in a front face lock now. Hmm? As this is bad for this is bad for Vince, this is very bad for Vince. Wait a second, what is he going for? Oh! A slay calls at the rock hard slam. And oh, wait a Slade's got on top of the turnbuckle. And he kisses that Grillo teen Slade drop. Yeah, guillotine, uh, uh, Gorilla team, whatever. I'm going for a pin. Oh no! One, two, yes. and three! Oh. Wow! Gorilla team, that's what I was supposed to say. Gorilla team, I don't know what that down. is. Who's your champ? Who's your winner? Slade. Wow, interesting. As that was a nice big win for Slade. That was a that was a big win for Slade, a, a huge win over a veteran like Vince. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that is. Uh, yeah, that is a huge win. Mm -hmm. All right. As that was one hard fall match. Oops, one second. Go ahead and talk. I'll be back in one second. All right. As as we just finished as we just finished the match between Slade and Vince Easterwood, as that was a that was a f good match altogether. As Maxine helps Vince out, as Maxine does have to defend that title against Lyra and Allison Danes next week at Clash at the Beach. So, so of course, that's going to be an awesome match to see, as we know, as tonight, as it has been a hell of a show, as, early, as earlier tonight, as we had Hillary take on Allison Danes, and... And Hilly went mental on us again, and but however, she, however, Allison hit one of the hardest DTs I've seen for a long time, and she basically won the match. And huh? Wait, wait, wait was Alfie? Seems like we got something going on backstage as we have a camera back there. Okay, I'm back. What's going on? Uh, something's happened backstage. Uh oh! Oh boy. Wonder what they got going on backstage. Oh, what the hell? Uh, well, look who is it is. Hi there, John. We got a few questions for you. Hope you don't mind answering. 
Wait, is that Jaws truck? Um, hey there, kid. Um, look, you know who I am. I'm the VWE World Heavyweight Champion. I'm the guy who retired Shinja, and I also am a member of the Descent. See, let's cut to the chase. You know as well as I do that Impact Mafia have a third member, and quite frankly, we may not we may not know who it is, but we got a few people who could be it, and you're on the list. Congratulations. See. We all know you've been struggling to find your feet, especially since your much more talented brother left, so this may be your best option. We both know you can't do anything on your own, so why not join the Mafia? And plus, we all know your history here with Riker, so this could be the best option for you. So you have two choices, the hard way or the easy way. The hard way is where you lie and we beat you until you can't walk anymore, and the easy way is you tell the truth, and everyone's happy. Your choice. Answer it! I have no idea what you guys are talking about. Let me go! I'll let you go when I'm goddamn good and ready. Answer it! Like I said, I have no idea what y'all are talking about. John, you have eyes and you have ears. You saw what happened last week. They have a third member. And we think it's you, so you better start talking. Y'all got the wrong guy. It's not me. Likely story. Oh, John. Well, we can all see which way he's going. He's not going to be willing, so how about we make him a more willing uh, participant in this, Cody. What do you say? Oh, I agree. <laughs> you asked for it, John. Oh, come on, really? <laughs> really? They, they're they just friggin' still on that <laughs> witch hunt and... <sighs> Oops. Did I hit you too hard? Yeah, the witch hunt continued. What the hell? John, what did I say? Ah, I don't think All right, so someone gets someone back there. Someone gets someone back there. Someone. So we someone gets someone back there. Oh my god, what the hell? Come on, he, he was supposed to be in what our main event. What the hell is that? Ah, well, Descent claims another victim. But it seems like we're going to be moving on to a quick break, so, uh. Since you did the advertisement last time, I'll do it this time. So, do you want to learn more about okay. your favorite SL wrestlers and SL wrestling? TyrusDenova.blogspot.com has your information on your favorite re SL wrestlers. Update weekly with new interviews. If interested, contact Tyrus Terevi in World. Wildfire! Did I catch your attention? Please say it did. Ladies and gentlemen, are you looking to up your arsenal of Blaze and Hot videos? Team Wildfire can make that happen with 100% custom videos as well as the Fire Package. Catch our classes on www.youtube.com slash Lyra Team Wildfire. If you want to get in contact with us, contact Lyra Phoenix or yours truly, Captain Falcon. Team Wildfire, it's time to burn. Get like me, big baby animations by Derek Holt, giving your brand new animations and custom videos in the world of professional wrestling in Second Life. For more information, contact Derek Holt in World. While catch the latest happenings in Second Life Wrestling, Digital Wrestling Roundtable is a bi weekly talk show hosted by Kurt, uh, hosted by Kurt Bombastic, Mama Yashio, Lelandra Lancaster, Ash Cravo, and Maxine Darkwatch as they discuss all the best news in SL Wrestling. We talk about all the hot topics going on in and out of the ring, providing show results of your favorite federations. You can join us every other Friday at 2.30 p.m. SLT at the DBWRT Studios on the Island of Misfit Wrestlers, or on our website, join our group, or on Facebook page. DWRT, we put the fun dysfunctional. Sinful Desires, located at the Korea Sim, is a club with nightly events and DJs, including some of your favorite wrestlers from VWE on staff. Sinful Desires is your one-stop fun is your one stop for fun, dance, music. We also have a male variety of different shops and store locations right across the club. Sinful Desires, your leaders in the entertainment. Not only is Vu Cooperstone a wrestler, he's also a DJ and a cop. 
from blues to some of your most kick-ass rock and roll here in Second Life, appearing at such places as Fogbound Blues, Toby's Juke Doik, Sinful Desires, and even on the web at www.474themix.com or 965 Noise. Guaranteed fun, great music, and great people. Tune in, lock on, and bring those requests. Even join his his group fans and friends of DJ Voodoo for all the updated information. <laughs> for all the updated info, all you need to do is ask. He'll keep you dancing, head banging, or just plain rocking. VW, VWE.cc update regularly with right, with with results and exclusive interviews, as well as videos and merchandise of your favorite superstars and bombshells. Mr. Week of VWE, want to know more about what's going on within the VWE Nation? Catch up on our site. Yes, your one-stop shop for everything VWE. VWE.cc Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming to VWE tonight as we are prompt for your entertainment. Please feel free to donate any possible linens behind the commentary table in the collection box located right behind us. Any and all donations are certainly appreciated. If you've been looking for a way to promote yourself or your place of business outside the normal means of simple ad boards or wasting your money on classifieds, if you want your spots, if you want your products or services to be seen and heard in front of a live studio audience, VWE is now offering new sponsorship packages. Sponsoring the VWE is a great way to promote your product and services as well as promote you throughout our arena, on our website, during our two weekly live shows, and on our show replays. Please feel free to contact Ash Crevo, SL Name, Frank Yelchitz, or Jen Parker for pricing packages, or click on one of the ad boards located directly above the main entrance. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, that has been your Are answer you okay? today. Are you yep, okay? I'm good. I'm good. Take a drink. Get a drink. Okay, yep. so we move on to match number three. So, and since you just went through that mind-blowing, win-taking experience. Um, oh, no. Oh, boy. Production monkeys are telling me. I we got that. further word that after cameras turned off, Cody had come back and nailed John's knee as well with the kendo stick, rendering his old knee injury. Oh, John struck, cannot stand on his own power, so the match has been canceled. What? Canceled? You can't cancel the main, main event. event. Really? Those are our main events. What the hell? Well. Hi. Oh, my God. Oh, wait. Wait, uh -oh. hold up. What's this? Oh! Oh, boy. Is that the music of who I think it is? Oh, that is indeed that music, ladies and gentlemen. Not to mention the song has some sick guitar riffs. Oh, I... Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to be met by the team that's been reformed. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Impact Mafia. <laughs> why are they why are they in their ring gear? They're not even booked for tonight. However that may be seen. I don't know. You know, it's always good to come prepared, so Gentlemen, looks like they got the floor. They're out here to say something. So,
Up. Up. They come out here. Obviously, they got something to say. What's good, VW? What's good, big baby? That's right, big baby. Now, 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 I, now that I see Descends attacking, attacking more people backstage. Wait, Seriously, are you, I'm still are you standing. really surprised? Are you really surprised? Cody taking care of his competition because he's too afraid to face the competition. After all, he's afraid to face me, you know. <laughs> Well, it seems like Cody want to take out John Strzok because he's too scared to face him one on one. So I guess he don't have a point opponent to face tonight. So what do you yeah, think, Kurt Bombastic? Yeah, no, he, I, oh my God, he doesn't have an opponent. Oh, I wonder who can face him, Derek. Hmm. Oh, he's got this clause that, you know, he doesn't want to face me, so obviously he's too afraid to do that. Uh, who can face, who can face? Well, let's see, I'm in my ring gear, but no, I'm out of the question. Um, Sam was in his ring gear, but no, no, he's busy with, he's busy with David Hawk actor, so, um, uh, hmm, I don't know. It's pretty odd. Oh, wait, 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 I know, I know, I know, I know. You're in your ring gear, Derek! Oh shit! I think I, I I have a great idea. Hey Cody, why don't you go one on one with the great one, Derek Colt? <laughs> uh, you know, like I said, I'm liking that idea. Oh wait, now oh, we're hearing there's a text from the chairman's office. Oh, you guys are gonna like this up there in the ring. Um. They have, uh, the chairman has approved Derek's request and granted it as a VWE world title match tonight. <laughs> well, it looks like we're going to... seems like you have your date for tonight, Big Baby. Yeah, it looks like uh, stage five is just going to be up a little bit closer. Descent and Cody... You're about to get a taste of what's in store for you next week at Beach Brawl. <laughs> wow. Just like that. Up, oh, up. Oh, there you go, folks. The main event's still on. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. As this could be a main event, Cody Hooley is going one-on-one -on -one with Derek Colt. Going one-on-one -on -one with the great one. Uh oh, they must be approving some other wrestler. His name is an error occurred. But um Oh. Well, it looks like the Impact Mafia <laughs> throwing that challenge. You know, Cody taking out his other opponent, John Struck. Now he's coming in to take out uh now he's gonna have to face Derek Colt in a world title match. That should make for some good wrestling right there. Woo. Damn right, ladies and gentlemen. That's right, right. though. That's gonna be one hell of a match, but you know. Oh, I know, right? All right. Um all right, I'll announce this one. So okay. let's move on to match three. Coming out first at a height of a six foot even, weighing two hundred pounds from Moscow, Russia. She is Nikoleta Lukov. Boy, this oh, Russian man, juggernaut. Because the videos aren't working for me right now. Is it working for you? Oh, yeah, it is. Well, mine says an I'll error. I'll tell you right or... now. As Ni hmm. Well, Nikola is going to be going against Garcia Kovac tonight, and I know Nikola wants to get her hands on her. Hmm.
I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> this match is gonna be good, and I mm -hmm. like Nicholas chances. Mm -hmm. Huh? And her opponent in a five, height of five foot eleven, weighing 125 pounds, from New York, New York, representing Descent, Christina Krovac. Yeah, I, I'm liking Nicoletta's chances. What is that on Christina's face? Uh, I don't know. Oh, it's a mask. Why is she wearing a mask? Oh, oh, look what you did to me. Oh, it's a oh. protection, face protection. <laughs> and Nicola's like, I'm wrestling Catwoman, I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I don't know, I think the mask might make her look a little better. I mean, it's just my opinion, though. Well, I don't know. It's gonna be an interesting match as it is scheduled, and I know Nicola wants to get her hands on Christina. Mm -hmm. It's Christina saying, "I'm clean. Get off you." As we as we wait for the ref to you know get this match underway. Yep, and it looks like the ref is going to ring the bell. Oh, Alfie Denzel ringing the bell and getting this thing started. Yeah, and, well, I'm going to tell you right Nic now, Nicolella, I think she has it easy. Oh, that's almost close immediately. Line. <laughs> yeah, Casina, Nicola is not going to watch your face. Yeah, she not really. Uh, she don't really care. So she's still pissed off about getting fired. Supposed to be, you know, her boss and you know a friend, and so you know, yeah, she has a lot of ill will no, towards Christina. Oh, what? She's coming in. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ! Well, I'm getting word that as a side note about uh, Christina's mask that she's wearing is medically approved protection for her face after the bike explosion. Oh, I thought, oh, she was milking it. Oh, she milked it. <laughs> and wait a second, it looks like uh, Alfie is saying, keep it legal, I'll DQ you, Nicola. Open those fists. As you know, those fists of hers are pretty damn big. She could knock out a guy with that. Just ask Max Maxwell. Oh my boy, here comes Nick Land. Oh my god, big boots! And then Christina right, right on top of the floor now. Jesus Christ, and oh, Nick Land is just going right after her. Right? Oh my goodness. And the ref is just shouting get back in here, but I don't think she wants to I don't think she She's wants not to, you know. Yeah. She don't care. She wants to hurt her. Yeah, oh Jesus. Oh and there goes Christina as she hits the table. That wait a second. Uh oh, oh we don't need another broken table tonight. Please? Oh, yeah. Oh. oh! Oh! 
Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, don't break the table. They already fixed it. Whoa! Oh, no. Oh, oh my oh, God. Pizza. Snake Eyes off the table. Yeah, because she ain't going to wash the face. <laughs> She said the table hair face. And there goes Christina right back into yeah. the ring. You know what? I'm not going to argue with Nicoletta. Go ahead. Beat up Christina all you yeah. want. <laughs> I wouldn't argue with her either. <laughs> and wait, Nicoletta's yeah. going for the pin. Huh? One. Huh? And two. And only uh, two count. Only get, yeah, only getting a two. Oh, well, yeah, but she had to really, uh, you know, she had to really use muscles and, you know, and, and, and she had to, you know, kick out. You know, that can wear you down just having to kick out. I mean, that's that's a lot of accident, a lot of movement just to, you know, especially from a woman so big sit laying right on top of you. Oh, throwing her off into the corner. Oh, boy. There goes Nicolette going on oh. the other side as uh -oh. <laughs> this is going to be a big move. No, oh, somebody going to get the number of that truck? Oh boy, I think so. As oh. here comes Nicolette oh. as she misses. As, Nicol as oh. Christina rolls out of the way, thankfully, as she goes up to the other side. Uh oh. It looks like Nicolette's holding to her head as Christina's sizing her up right now. As right, so she rolls and here oh, she, she comes at what the three rolls into a oh into a nice into goodie. Oh, uh, uh, she would have been better off running the three rolls. I mean, you know, at it, but that kind of slows down your momentum, don't it? Oh, that's my opinion. I don't know, but it looks like Christina is carefully picking apart Nicoletta. And she says time to fly in. Oh, boy. And this is a bad spot for Nicoletta to be. And she doesn't know where Christina is. As the ref is already starting to count. As he said, one. And wait a second. And because Christina hits a nice moonsault. And she brings down Nicoletta. Right, so she's going for pin one, two, and I don't think so. Nope. As I like Christina gets up and it looks like she's just carefully looking to to see what she could do against Nicoletta. As Casina has just picked up her foot. Now, is it what? What is she about to do? Hi. Busy, busy, busy. Wait a second. Uh oh, wait a second. As as Casina's going for a figure four. Oh. Uh over that figure four. Oh, that hurts. Oh, yes, it does. As this, this is a bad spot for Nicolette to be right now. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, that's painful. Yep, as the ref is saying, what you saying, Nicoletta? As the crowd is just shouting, don't tap. As mm -hmm. she, Nicolette's trying to drag herself to her ropes. As she's dragging herself as she has that upper body strength as she has her up against. Mm -hmm. Oh, she hit, she grabs the ropes. But I don't think Christina's going to break it easily. No. Nope. Of course not. She's a member of Descent. They cheat. Hmm. Using the, but she is using the, uh, the three, uh, the, the, the standing five count. 
Oh, oh, she finally break it. Oh, yep. Yep. I mean, she does have the use of the standing five count to break the hold. If she does not break the hold by five, she can be disqualified, and she would lose. Nasty stomps to the midsection. Yeah, Christina is not playing any games tonight. She, she, in her mind, she needs to take out Nicola now. Mm hmm. Oh, go for that pin. Uh oh. You're gonna one. one. A two. two. Oh. And no cigar. I'll be saying two. Uh oh. She's going all Hillary on us. Oh, God. Oh. Christina's saying it's over. Oh, uh, one. Uh, she says it's over, she picks up and what is it? She has Nicola by her head and she's going for the raindrop and oh! oh! She manages to dodge it! Oh yeah, she managed to roll her way through. Yeah, so she's really tall, so um yeah, the, her height may have been an advantage to keep her from uh uh being caught in the raindrop. Uh oh Nicola got her God, up in the grill yes. press. Uh oh, oh. Oh, no, you know what comes after this. Uh oh. What goes up oh! must come down. And she has a fall oh, from grace. Over the pin. One, two, two three. And three. Mm -hmm. Ladies and your winner of this match is Nikolai Lukov. Yeah, see, some videos are just being stupid for me today. Probably. Hmm. Well, this is SL. Oh, this is just good remember, once they fix something, you wait five minutes, it'll be broken again. Yeah, where's the eye? Nicola is saying, where's your descent now? <laughs> I'll take one. There's one right there. That's Go a good ahead. question. And, uh oh. Settle down there, psycho. Oh, boy. Yeah, she wants a mic. Uh, yeah, here you go, Christina. Go right there, go, Dad. Oh, she got something to say. You can read. You got a girly voice. Uh, she says, hey, Nicoletta, wait a second, get back here, you censoring bitch. Just say it. <laughs> Basically, she said, get back here, you fucking bitch. Wow. See, I'm not done I'm with not you. I only lost because I was injured after the explosion. You caused and I wasn't 100%. See? Yeah, she's still blaming her for an explosion for that motorcycle. What the hell? So I demand a rematch. You owe me this much, Nicoletta. If it wasn't for me, you wouldn't be even be in the VWE. Oh. oh. Ouch. You beat me once. I beat you once. We need one more match to end this. Yeah, it's a rubber match. Find out who. So let's settle this once and for all. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. You and me. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. In a street fight at Beach Brawl. Ooh. A street fight? Oh, <laughs> oh she's like, what did you say? What do you say? Oh, she says, Christina, see you at Peach Brawl. So there you have it, folks. Street Fight, Christina versus Nicoletta. <laughs> oh, that's going to be a good match. Ooh, that should be interesting. Oh, 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 oh. 
is going to be very good. All right, so as we move on, ladies and gentlemen, that seems oh, like uh, oh. Chairman Cure, uh, Chairman Cure has got another bit of news, but we got now a live feed that we are putting on right now. Oh, oh, he finally got the camera. Oh. Uh oh, is it going to play? Oh, there it goes. Good evening, uh, ladies and gentlemen of the VWE universe. It's your chairman, Ben Baker X here. And I want to take a moment to address something that some of you might have questions about. First of all, being where I've been. Well, as most of you know, there's a problem in the VWE. And that problem is dissent. And I'm working to try and figure out how to handle this problem. But firstly, there's one thing that I've seen that is a grave injustice, and that's exactly how Stuart Wharf has been holding on to his belt. So, with that being said, I want to set up a stipulation for Beach Brawl. And this goes directly to Stu. Firstly, Stu, Descent will be barred from ringside during that match of yours. And secondly, if you get yourself disqualified, Count it out, or there's any underhandedness in any way, shape, or form perpetrated by you to try and retain the title, you lose the title. Beyond that, that's all I have to say, so I hope everyone enjoys the show tonight, and I'll see you all at Beach Brawl. Good evening, uh, ladies and gentlemen of the VWE universe. Well, wow. Ain't that some big news, ladies and gentlemen. So, it seems like if Cody Hooley tries to do anything out of the ordinary, he loses that title. <laughs> oh, boy. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I believe that we're going to be move on. Oh, it's a Stu's match. My bad. So, if Stu does anything out of the ordinary, like uh, get some help alongside, he's going to lose that title. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I believe we're going to be getting ready for a main event. Are you guys ready? <laughs> Looks like my co commentator is already in the middle of the ring, so... <laughs> Let's get ready. Let's bring out the opponents.
All right, BWE, make some noise. This is your BWE Edge main event. This match is for one fall, and it is for the BWE World Heavyweight title. Standing to my right, he weigh, he stands at a height of six foot seven, weighs two hundred forty pounds, from Houston, Texas. He is the great one, Derek. Colt! His opponent, he is the reigning VW World Heavyweight Champion, weighs in at 235 pounds at a height of six foot three from Toronto, Canada. He is the code, Cody Hooley. Well, this is going to be an awesome match to see, ladies and gentlemen, as we, there's a lot of title history around these two, ladies and gentlemen. We have Derek, multiple, multiple time title holder of many different titles. Cody Hooley, as, as in, in the records, he was the longest reigning European title holder, as well as the United States title holder, as he has the record for the longest, longest reign, and is currently the VWE World Heavyweight title holder so <laughs> this is gonna be a hell of a match as here comes Derek right away as he goes after Cody with a lot of elbow strikes elbowing Cody he's just just going to town on him and this this is bad for this is bad for Cody already as Jesus Christ, as those elbows could definitely bust you open immediately. Mm. And Here we go, oh not bad. God. Oh my God. Holy hell. Ooh. Oh, stop it away. Stop that mud hole in him. Whew. Oh my God, Derek is just blowing past everyone right now. As he kicks into the gut, as he's going for that stunner, but no. As he, as Cody shoves him off, and Derek hits the ropes, going right after Cody. And oh, Cody hitting that, that nice drop. Oh, kick. oh yeah. Hey, he got off that drop kick. And oh, as he just stomps on Derek right now. Stomping away at the great one. Jesus Christ. No, you gotta say it right. It's frosted Christ cakes. Get it right. Uh, oh, and he's just showing off right to the now, fans. Really? Showing off. Yeah. Oh, you notice that uh, Derek was accompanied by his fellow Impact uh, Mafia member, Kurt Bombastic, and Cody came down with Riker Malachi. So, um, I, I, I can tell you there's probably going to be some shenanigans involved. That's right. As it looks like Cody picks up Derek right now as he toss him over to Rose. Say here, here comes Derek again. Oh, he, Cody missed that clothesline as Derek rolls right under it. And here comes Derek Ooh. Colt as he has. Oh, oh that holy elbow. hell! Oh my that God! Toss him off the rope. Man. Oh! And oh! Back body drop. Oh 
Oh my god, that Derek is just waiting for Cody to get up. And it looks like he, Derek is just waiting. Just waiting for Cody. <laughs> He's waiting to hit him with something. And oh, it oh, seems like everybody's oh losing teeth lately. Oh! Wait, wait, hold up, hold up. Hold, wait a second, wait a second. What's the hell is Riker doing up on the on the apron? I don't know, but Derek is Derek wants him to come in. <laughs> Derek said, "I got one for you." Also, as Viker just gets right off the ropes, that's smart of him right now. The Colonel says to give him back his cornbread. Oh. I don't know, but it looks like Cody's backing up. Oh, that's as Cody. Cody says, "Derek, no." Oh, retreated like let's knock this out. <laughs> Oh dear, this is not going to end well for Cody. And it looks like Derek is just waiting. Just, it's like, like almost like he's just waiting for Cody to try something. Cody just going to prove that he isn't really worthy of that championship. Yep, as, oh, wait a second, Alfie's distracted by... And Mike right now. Oh my oh! god, are you serious? Nasty low blow kick. Sends a great one down. Come on now, really? And Derek just rolls out the ring. And uh oh, wait a second, we got Kurt and Riker out here. Uh oh. Oh, they're getting oh Riker getting his face. Oh, Kurt shoving him off. Oh. Oh boy, and Riker's like, you want some and Cody is just stopping away at, at Derek right now. As Cody throws Kurt right into the court. Oh my god, right into a steel steps. Wait a second, Cody's pick up Derek as he throws him right inside the oh. ring. Give me a hand, son. Yeah. Co Cody's going right, right after him. Wait a second, Cody hits the ropes as... Oh, he no. went for an elbow, but he missed! And huh? Derek, with that speed of his, just rolls that way quickly. Yeah, Derek, hey, he's very quick in the ring. You can't underestimate him. For a big guy, he moves pretty fast. Yep, and Cody does not know where Derek is. Well, here comes Derek. As, oh, oh no. As, oh, he's blocking, he's blocking those, oh, oh, elbow, oh, elbow, oh, these, oh my, oh my god, D, He's just D laying god. into him. <laughs> laying into him, left and right, and kicking. Holy shit, that's a lot. Oh, what's he doing now? Oh, Off wait, the he, ropes. Here's the ropes. Off hey, the other the other side. Oh, wait, here. And last flash kick. kick. Right in the face. Oh. Let's go for a pinfall. One, two. And only a two count. And Derek just gets up and he's just going. <laughs> he's going to be going out after Cody as he throws him right to the corner. And, uh oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh no. And wait, no. wait a second, oh. Riker's hold on to Derek's foot. Really? Oh, Alfie caught him. Oh, he's trying to rub yep, fuck man. you. Oh, come on. And yeah, here comes Derek as he's going for that roll over one. Oh, Cody rolled out of the way. God damn it, Alfie, I wouldn't take that shit. Throw that piece of shit out. Anyway. That's true, as it looks like Cody has Derek by where he wants me, as he hits him with a, dota, uh, with a thermical thrust, and no oh. one. Oh. Yep. I'll be telling him to get, get out of the corner. But it looks like a. Dragging him out with a front face lock. Oh, yeah. Oh, dragging him, yeah, with that front face lock. As he tosses Derek back to Rose, here comes Derek. Oh, oh. no! Belly to belly! Uh-oh, what's going on? Oh, 
What's Kurt? I don't know. Oh, he didn't yeah, know the mic. Oh, Cody, Cody says talk. learn, Cody Cody Cody. learn. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh look like, at Kurt. Oh, oh, off the oh. Stairs. It beating the crap out of Riker over there. Oh, oh I, Derek, that will close line. Missed the clothesline. Oh, and oh, Cook's school lariat. Uh oh, Derek this is where Derek up. gets nasty. Uh oh, uh oh. In the elbow, oh. side elbow strike. That man is the master of the elbow. Go for the pin. One, one, two, two and no. And only a two. Oh, Riker's uh, feeling it over there. That's right, as Derek does Cody right to the ropes and oh, Derek went for that lariat, but he missed. Uh, and Cody's right behind him. Yes. Uh, wait, he's going for it. Go for that school ball roll oh, up. Wait, 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 he was holding the tights. Oh, Alfie even saw it. Tights. Yep. Oh. And oh, Derek missed again with that clothesline. Now wait, here he here comes Cody as oh kick to the gut. And he's going for that oh wait, oh. wait a second. He's going oh. for that oh that double lock DDT. Nasty. Oh, oh Derek kinda of felt that one. Go for the pin. One. One two two and no. I'm only getting a two. Uh oh, what's Riker doing now? Kurt, turn around. Oh no. Oh! Oh, oh he. Oh, he's slapped oh, him he in the back of the head. Him. Did he just gib slap him in the back of the head? He just gib slap him. <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh oh. Oh. oh Cody God. up there oh. needed Derek. <laughs> you hit the hit oh. him with a Derek with a forearm club off the ropes. And up, oh, Derek. Oh, flipped. wait a second. He caught himself. Caught himself. Oh no. Oh boy. And Cody's like, oh yeah, he's going after him. Mafia kick right to the face. Uh oh. Uh oh. Cody kind of stumbled his way over into the corner. Oh, yeah, oh here we go. Oh, that chop kick combo. Oh my god. Uh oh. As Derek is just going after us, Ref is counting. And uh -oh. oh wait a second, Alfie better watch out. <laughs> As here comes Derek. Oh corner, corner rolling elbow. Oh, 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 Got him with that corner rolling elbow. Oh that shit had to hurt. Kurt's looking, uh saying, Come on, Riker, make my day. Yeah, try something again and see what happens to you, Kurt. Oh Oh he shoved him, Kurt shoved him off. Oh Oh wait, Kurt went for uh, Derek went for a death blow, but Cody mit Cody shoved him in. No high knee. And Derek just stumbled back into the corner. As I'm trying to make sure that the match in, inside the ring is actually, you know, being commentated. <laughs> and here comes Cody right after, right after Derek. And, oh! oh, corner in security. Yeah, hit him that corner in security. Didn't really take him down. Stunned oh, him no. enough. Uh -oh. oh. He has him in that Koji clutch. Uh-oh. Oh, but, oh, wait a second, but... but Cody's trying to make Derek tap already, but it looks like Derek is just trying to power that out. That won't have nothing to do with it. It's a bad spot for Derek also. And Cody's like, T tap before I snap your neck. Oh, dear. Oh, but oh, wait a second. Derek yeah, is uh -oh. feeling it. Uh-oh. Derek's feeling it. Uh-oh. He's like, hell no. Nah. He ain't tapping out. Oh. oh, he's doing something even weirder. He's, he's actually scooting backwards. Got his feet under the ropes. That should be a rope break right there. That is a rope break. Nice call on that one. Two. Oh, uh, Cody, let's go. Wonder how Derek's feeling after the effects of that. That Cody clutch. Oh, dragging him up. Oh, he says I'm ending what him. Is it what did you, oh, what's he uh -oh. got in mind here? 
You drag him out to the front, oh, out no. to the center of the ring. This is a bad spot for Derek to be if Cody wants to end it. Oh, he's looks like he's oh, going for the code, code breaker. Code breaker. Oh, but wasted, but he missed. Oh, Derek pushed it off. No. Oh, kicking him in the gut. <laughs> off the ropes. Oh, he goes. Yep. Derek. Yeah, whoa, wait a second. Missing a high knee. Derek off the ropes off the other side. And he went for it and. Oh, no. Oh, oh my no. God. Giant swing. As round and round and round he goes. Where he stops, nobody knows. Big money, big money, big money, big money, big money. No whammy, no whammy, no whammy, no whammy. Stop! Hey, Baba, hey, Baba, hey, Baba, hey, Baba, hey, Baba. Swing! Oh, gee, look at that. He's even put more room behind it. Oh, my God. Derek is just going to... Oh, my God. Hey, Don't mean anything if you got that many... swing, right? Um, how many swings has done? I don't know. I lost track. I lost track. I'm dizzy. Yeah, I, I just lost count. Oh, he just oh, released them. It had to be at least 20. Yeah. If not more. <laughs> Alvy's even feeling the effects. He said he's even feeling dizzy. Oh, Derek trying to catch his breath a little bit. And Cody's, Cody's all dizzy over there. Looks like he's swinging at nothing. Oh, wait a second, but here comes Derek and... Oh, oh my God! Hit him with that inside elbow, grabbing him in a face lock, dragging him off the ropes. Yeah, oh, wait a second. Oh! Rip court elbow! Oh. Go for the pin! And let's go for... One! One! We got a two! Two and... Oh, come on, Riker. Oh! He just... Wait a sec, come on now. And, oh, wait a sec, there's no oh, him and stop! Oh my god, and he just lights him out right out of the ring. Oh. Wait a sec, wait a sec, it's bad, it's bad for, for Derek oh. as Cody's right behind him. And he's going for the code breaker. And no, Derek shoved him off. Oh boy. Uh oh, he, oh, he dies. Wait a second. Let's go for the different oh, great shuffle. Uh oh, uh oh, this is bad. This is bad for him. Oh, this is bad for Cody as Cody doesn't know where Derek is. And oh my God. Uh oh, oh, elbows, elbows, more. Uh oh, wait a second. He's he's doing that shimmy. He's doing that shimmy. And oh my God. Oh. I think Cody's out. He may be. Oh, wait a second, but... Oh, wait. I think uh, Derek's about to finish this now. Oh, he's going for a light oh! out. Oh! Another light's out. Cody... Cody Roll out. ducks right out of the way. And Cody oh! is... Co Where's Cody going? Where the hell are you going? No! Wait, wait. You... No! Why should I give you your title? You're supposed to be in a match. Get in the ring. Yeah, yeah get back in there. Really? really? Oh, this just goes to prove you're a paper champion. Title holder, title warmer. You're a bitch. And Cody is just getting... Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, oh, this is bad for Cody. Oh, boy. Kurt's like, where are you going? Oh boy, and Derek is going right after him. Uh oh, and Riker's oh my God! Him. Oh, tackle him right to the ground! Oh, for the love of Pete! Oh my God! And wait a second, they're, they're both going at each other, and they're just, <laughs> they're just oh my! I, I don't know how cold it is. As they're just both just going at. You gotta watch the standing ten count. And Co and. Kurt's now getting into it as he's fighting Riker. As 
Descent and friggin' Impact Mafia are just going at it. They're just friggin' going after Off each goes. other. Wow, Alfie's up to a seven. Oh! Eight. Eight. Oh, they're just beating the crap out of each other. Uh oh, bad yeah, dude. Yeah, they don't even care. It oh, that's it. Uh oh. Ladies and gentlemen, this match has ended in double countout. However, let's get to the action as they're just still going at it right now. Current hitting those stiff, wee tight knee strike combo all over. Uh, oh! As, oh my god! As Derek is just Somebody elbow strike after elbow. Yeah, someone needs to stop this. Hey, it's, can we get someone out here or, or try to stop this? And oh, Cody for eye rake. And oh, it looks like Cody's trying to get the hell up out of Dodge right now. Oh, oh yeah, Cody running. Same thing as Riker. Put his tail between his legs. To show that Descent's a bunch of pussies can't handle a match. Just goes to prove that, you know what everybody says, maybe he is just a paper champion, so. All right, right folks, you're gentlemen, back that's been no uh, contest or uh, double count out, so. Yeah, you want to wrap it up? Go ahead. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this has been the end of tonight's edition of VWE Edge, ladies and gentlemen. This has been your captain, Captain Rainbow Falcon, alongside with... Ronway Yashiro. And we'll catch you guys next week. Peace out. Yes, next week is Beach Ball. This video was filmed on location by Zarakan Productions. Zarakan Productions is an umbrella group for many YouTube shows and businesses both inside and outside of Second Life. Please go to zarakan.com for a complete listing of shows and businesses associated with Zarakan Productions and their own media links. Zarakan Productions shows have been organized alphabetically in playlists in a year, month, day format for easier video navigation. Multiple part videos have been named accordingly starting with part 1, and the last video of a multiple part video series will have end as a part of its title. Please like, comment, and share this video as it helps both Zarakan Productions, and the creators of this video's content. Also, be sure to check the playlists for past episodes of show content, and subscribe to this channel for future videos. Thank you for watching, and happy wandering.